Nothing. Nothing? You said it was an emergency. An emergency of sorts. Um, what do you know about Satsuma and Indian legend? Um, not a lot. Good. Okay. You can be my authority. Shut up. Hi! You came. Thanks. She told you it was an emergency? I'm Jay. We didn't really get a chance to meet officially. You're the girl that was talking to my dead grandma. It's inanimate people, too? You said you had something at first. Please tell me you didn't take it off the body. No. It was in the dirt. Someone must have dropped it. Uh, this is from that rack. Well, actually, it's mine. Okay, how about this? You getting anything? Does that belong to my grandma? I don't understand. I, I don't understand. Is there some reason I'm here? Is this about a timeshare? No timeshare, but there is a video. I can't watch a video. Tax season is a very busy time for me. I have things to do. I'll fast forward through the beginning. We'll get right to the meat, please. For your grandma. I'll give you a gift certificate. Gift? You'd like a gift, wouldn't you? And because Layla Walla, daughter of Chief Eagle Eye, surrendered to her destiny, the tribe lived on in peace and prosperity. There. See? That's what you need to do. Throw myself over the falls? No! Surrender to destiny. You have to follow in Grandma's footsteps. Ah, oh, you're one of those. It's in your blood. You're the next in line. I gave up that line a long time ago. I've got a new line now. Thanks, though. No, no, no. The new line is the wrong line. The old line is the line you want to be in. Grandma's line. So you can claim your gift. Whatever it is you're looking for, you're looking in the wrong spot. I don't have a gift. Any gift. Oh, you do. You do have the gift. It's your destiny. What did the Maid of the Mist teach us about destiny? The Maid of the Mist isn't even a real myth. It was just fabricated by Whitey to bring in tourists. What if the gift was hormonal like menopause and develops as you mature? I mean, when was the last time you checked? I've been checking since I was born. So has everyone else. Why do you think I left? But Grandma... I broke my Grandma's heart. It's like... She knitted a sweater for me I could never wear. When I was a young boy, I would pretend I could talk to spirits just to make her happy. But they just thought I was retarded. I can't go back. I have no place there. My place was reserved for someone with a gift I don't have. But how do you know for sure? Like, for sure, for sure. Yeah. Many of the great spiritual leaders didn't even realize they had gifts until they were called on to use them. Ooh, that's good. St. Paul was just a punk until he was blinded by the light, and Gandhi was just drinking and horned up with his friends until he heard the cry of his people. And Neo was just a big geek until he swallowed that little red pill. I'm kind of a geek. Yes, you are. But in a good way, like Neo. So come on, take the red pill. You know you wanna. Son of Gentle Feather has returned to us. We will commence with the journey of the feather. The feather is drawn to the energy of the seer through concentration and reflection. It'll be the first sign that Bill Hooten has the gift. Someone's having a spiritual awakening. He is? You think so? Not him. He's having a panic attack. You. You're having a spiritual awakening. That's the stupidest thing I've ever heard. You're stupid. You're being called. Yeah. 
Well, I'm transferring the call to his extension. You recognize anything? Not really. I don't think Grandma smoked a pipe, and I'm not sure if she wore glasses. Just relax. Open yourself up to the experience. Psst! Pick me! Pick me! Pick me! Pick me! Me! Pick me! Airway Balski. The Bear Skull. Yay! You got one right! I think we can all see who the new seer is going to be. Commune with Gentle Feather. There's not going to be any communing. He's not the guy. The feather didn't land on him, and I saw you cheat. I think you're the guy. That's crazy. Why are you fighting this? Is it because you're lazy? Do you just not want the responsibility? I admit that's a factor. But let's face it, searing or whatever isn't my destiny. I'm just not cut out for that kind of work. And you think he is? Look at him. The man's an accountant, Jay. An accountant. He can't even get the pipe lit. They're making a fool out of him. Oh my god, you're right. This is very cruel. What have I done? I'm like those parents who force their uncoordinated children to play sports. Someone's got to put him out of his misery. You have to tell him the truth. Right, but he. <gasps> oh my God! Oh. He doesn't have a pulse. This is the final test. To de <gasps> we thought we lost you. Technically, he's supposed to bring himself back to life. Was I dead? For like a minute. Which means you might have brain damage, so you should probably get that checked. I touched the other side. I saw my grandmother. She was like a vision in the mist. Did she speak to you? She told me not to go into the light. Did she say anything else? Anything about, I don't know, silencing voices or... No, nothing like that. She said I lost my path, but that I would find it again. That's not very specific. Or helpful. I talked to my dead grandmother. And I came back. I do have the gift. This is my path. This is my path. I found it. Come here. Finally. It's happened. Don't you think it's cruel to let him believe he's the new seer when clearly he's not? I mean, clearly. It isn't Mahandra Tanawanda. No, it isn't.